Yo everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a review of another range of Nip and Fab products for you guys. Today's video will be specifically in regards to the Salicylic Fix range. Now, if you are a subscriber of mine, firstly, thank you so much for subscribing. Secondly, you would have hopefully already seen the video that I did of the Glycolic Fix range. Now, Nip and Fab got in touch with me again and asked if I'd like to try out their Salicylic Fix range and I was really excited. Obviously, I was gonna say yes, especially because my skin type is normal to combination, but it's also kind of acne prone. And the reason why I say kind of acne prone is because this texture that you can see on my skin is actually as a result of scars that I got as a teenager between the ages of 14 and 16. I had really, really bad cystic acne and I used to pick my skin. I used to do things that I refuse to publicly say that I used to do to my skin to get rid of spots and then obviously it left me with scarring. However, my spots have definitely calmed down over the years. I like to believe that I had so many spots within those two years that God said, you know what, she's had enough and we're not gonna give her cystic acne anymore. However, that's not to say that I still can't benefit from products like salicylic acid that helps towards problematic skin clogged up pores and that sort of thing so let me just explain to you a little bit about what salicylic acid actually is and i'm actually online right now looking down at my phone just to give you the proper kind of medical definition for those of you that are unaware of what it is and how it could potentially benefit you it's a product that is used to treat mild to moderate acne it may be used in combination with other acne treatments salicylic acid belongs to a class of drugs known as salicylic Salicylates. When applied to the skin, salicylic acid may work by helping to shed the dead skin cells from the top layer of your skin by decreasing redness and swelling, aka inflammation. This decreases the number of pimples that form and speeds healing. Salicylic acid is also a BHA, meaning it is a beta hydroxy acid. So yes, it is an acid, obviously it's in the name. And it's well known for reducing acne by exfoliating the skin and keeping your pores clear. So pretty much everybody out there wants to have beautifully exfoliated skin and pretty much everybody wants to keep their pores clear, right? They say that salicylic acid penetrates into your skin and works to dissolve the dead skin cells clogging your pores. It can take several weeks of use for you to see the full effect. In regards to me using it for today's review, I've used it for about three weeks, just under a month call it, and I've been using all of these products intermittently, meaning I haven't been using them every single day because it is not necessary to use acids on your face every single day because it can actually do the opposite and give you breakouts. There is actually an entire range of salicylic products from Nip and Fab, but in particular the ones I'm gonna share with you guys today is this Salicylic Fix Gel Cleanser, the Salicylic Fix Pads, which are for nighttime, so they're like toner pads, the Salicylic Fix Facial Scrub, and we've got the Salicylic Fix Concentrate Extreme 2%, which is basically like a serum, and then we've also got the Anti Pollution SPF 30 Moisturizer, which is basically an SPF as well as a moisturizer. And in between in this video, you are going to see me using it on my skin. Bear in mind, this camera you're seeing right now is a full HD camera, and what I tend to use for my skincare videos is not purely because I nearly dropped this camera in my bathroom once and it's a very expensive camera and I refuse to do it ever again but if you really want to see what my skin looks like in real HD here it is no filters or anything like that applied post editing it's just that that camera is a lower quality camera that's it so the first thing we've got is the salicylic fix gel cleanser it is massive at 145 mil right now on nip and fabs website it is 595 but its normal retail price is 995 so this comes with a pump on the top as you guys can see and it is quite a runny sort of cleanser now because it is a gel cleanser even when you mix it with a little bit of water some foaming does occur but not too much because it is not necessarily a foaming cleanser however I find that this applies to the skin very very easily I also find that after using this rubbing it into my skin all over the place I use this every single morning and have done for the past few weeks I find that my skin doesn't feel dry or tight after using it and that is obviously a plus for me and what they've said about this is gently cleanse and purify the skin with salicylic fix gel cleanser with salicylic acid to lift away dirt impurities and excess oil combined with allantoin to provide a moisture barrier and lock in hydration use at night and wake up to bright refreshed complexion i like i said i've been using it in the daytime but it's completely up to you you can use this in the daytime as well as the nighttime key benefits are of course salicylic acid which are there to purify your congestion 
tested skin. Allantoin, which is a great humectant, providing a barrier of moisture to the skin, which is why it doesn't feel tight or dry after drying my face. And then an amazing ingredient again, which is niacinamide, which I love, which is there to control the production of sebum. So basically, especially if you've got really oily and congested skin, you will definitely love a cleanser such as this. Next up, we've got the Salicylic Fix Facial Scrub, which comes in this squeezy bright pink tube. Much like the Glycolic Fix version, this is a very mild type of exfoliator. This is also on sale at the moment with Nip and Fab for $5.95 and its normal retail price is $9.95. So what you're generally supposed to do is apply this to damp skin. It's completely up to you how much you choose to apply. I generally don't tend to apply this to my neck area. I just don't feel it's necessary. My spots and my congestion are kind of more on my face, like my chin, my cheeks, around the nose and a little bit on the forehead. So all you have to do is just rub it in and it very, very mildly exfoliates the skin and then you rinse it off and then you have lovely baby soft skin afterwards. So this one says that with salicylic acid to chemically exfoliate the skin and volcanic rock scrub to physically exfoliate the skin, the salicylic fix scrub is also infused with lotus flower and vitamin E to avoid stripping the skin. So its key benefits of course are again salicylic acid which are there to cleanse the pores and reduce the appearance of oily skin, vitamin E which acts as a skin conditioning agent and an antioxidant and then volcanic rock scrub which is there to give a natural and effective exfoliant. Because it does contain that volcanic rock it does feel a little bit gritty like you've got a little bit of salt in there but it's nothing strong enough to give you micro tears. It's very very mild so even if you've got super sensitive skin and just an FYI I actually shaved my face yesterday because I'm still in the process of using my IPL treatment so my skin is quite sensitive to day and this did not affect my skin whatsoever it didn't break it out it didn't make it go red it didn't irritate my skin all I can say is that after using this my skin felt super super soft and squeaky clean this you can definitely use on a daily basis I find that there are no issues with it when it comes to wash off kind of cleansers and scrubs generally you don't have to worry too much because it's not going to remain on your skin for too long meaning you can use it on a daily basis next up we've got the salicylic fix pads night and there is actually a day version but I've been sent the night version to be honest again I'd say it's completely up to you you can use this in the day or in the night I personally been using it at night time because I generally like to use my acids more at night because that's when I'm going to go to sleep and my skin is likely to repair itself so these at the moment are 10 pounds but their normal retail price is 14.95 and altogether there are 60 pads in here so if you did use this on a daily basis it would last up to two months which is excellent so these come in a tub with 60 cotton pads inside which are completely drenched in salicylic acid and various other ingredients there is a double-sided cotton pad one has got ridges one doesn't I don't really think it makes any difference to exfoliating the skin personally and I generally tend to rub it all over my face and then after two to three minutes it completely absorbs into the skin it doesn't irritate the skin or anything like that and what it says is that this stops breakouts in their tracks with salicylic fix night pads formulated to reduce breakouts with potent salicylic acid and a skin protective complex to support the healing process of active breakouts and to speed up recovery time. Its key benefits are obviously salicylic acid, there's hyaluronic acid in here as well which is there to hydrate and moisturize and then something called phytofuse rejuvenate which is there to speed up healing time. Now one thing I noticed with this in particular and especially in it controlling breakouts is that recently because it's quite cold in the UK at the moment, obviously it's winter time, um, when I've been going to work, we've got all the heating on and it's very warm. As soon as I go outside and it's cold, then I come back in and then my nose starts to run because I'm going between hot and cold. And because of the fact that I suffer from allergies, I'm always blowing my nose and I touch my nose a lot. And what ends up happening with me is I end up getting little whitehead breakouts around the edges of my nose, which is super, super irritating. And I know it's purely down to me constantly touching my face. I am a face toucher, which is why wearing makeup a lot of the time actually helps me stop touching my face. As soon as I touch my face, I will get a spot guaranteed. Now, because that kept happening, I was using this every single night for about a week. And I noticed slowly after two to three days, those little whiteheads would completely disappear so this is absolutely great for getting rid of breakouts as well as managing breakouts that may be trying to happen at the same time next up we've got this salicylic fix concentrate extreme two percent so this is a very small but very strong potent product which contains two percent salicylic acid which is more than enough to help with spots and breakouts and cleansing your pores and that sort of thing this is currently retailing at 12.95 and its normal retail price is 19 95. This is 30 ml, which is almost a standard amount for these kind of concentrated serums. Now, this comes in a pink color, so 
don't be scared that's just like the color of the range and it comes with a nice easy to use dropper which I just generally tend to place on my cheeks and around my nose and chin area but only a very small amount before I start to pat it in it's got quite a liquidy texture so it does tend to move all over the face you can manipulate where you place it like I placed it on my forehead for example and then within a couple of minutes it dries down completely it doesn't leave a sticky or tacky finish and it doesn't irritate or aggravate my skin whatsoever so what this says is that it contains 2% salicylic acid to reduce the appearance of enlarged pores and niacinamide to improve the appearance of uneven skin tone the salicylic fix concentrate extreme 2% is your go-to for clean fresh and purified skin so it says obviously its key ingredients are salicylic acid niacinamide and then it also contains lotus flower extract which is there to support the control of oil production it also contains glycerin which is a known humectant and it also contains panthenol which is obviously another great product and they have mentioned that there is perfume in here these are all scented if your skin doesn't agree with fragrance I would stay away from it. It's got a flowery kind of smell, but I'm not very good at describing flowery scents. I actually find the scent of this a lot more pleasant than the glycolic fix range, but obviously scents is a very personal choice. I think this is an amazing product and a lot of people will love this, especially if they suffer from regular and often breakouts, especially hormonal breakouts as well. A little bit goes a really long way. And this again helped in terms of the pores around the edges of my nose. My enlarged pores are generally kind of focused in this area and this area here and using a product such as this definitely made a difference to the appearance of my pores it kept them clear and them little breakouts as well as obviously using the night pads it helped to also use this however one thing I should mention is this is not something you should really use every single day I used it every two to three days but then I was happy to obviously use this pad every day. So the last thing I'm going to share with you guys today is the Nip and Fab Purify Anti-Pollution SPF Moisturizer. So this is currently at $15.95, but its normal retail price is $24.95. And the difference between this one and the glycolic one that I showed in the glycolic video is that this one is not dewy and illuminating like that one is. As you can tell, this kind of SPF is a lot more runny than the previous one. And because it's so runny, it means that I I can apply it a lot more quickly and it blends out into other areas without it snagging and needing too much blending there's absolutely no white cast whatsoever with this and I actually prefer this one I would say to the glycolic one purely because of how it performs I don't generally tend to like really dewy kind of SPFs not that I don't like that one it worked perfectly fine for me underneath my makeup it's just that I think that this one is a lot better I'm obviously using it underneath my makeup today and as you guys can see there's no shininess or anything like that so what this says is that it is a daily use moisturizer containing SPF 30 tailored to oily and congested skin for maximum hydration and protection. So this is basically a two-in-one moisturizer and SPF so it's obviously great for people that are in a hurry and on the go or if you're traveling and you just don't want to carry that many things. And it says that it is the perfect addition to the salicylic fix regime thanks to its lightweight and non-greasy feel which is completely how it is like I said. Formulated with an anti-pollution complex it helps to provide a breathable barrier against pollutants while chicory root extract helps skin appear more elastic and more supple. A skin pure fine complex also works to visibly rebalance the complexion reducing the appearance of oily and congested skin monoy oil helps leave the skin feeling replenished with a weightless hydration that sits perfectly under makeup which i have to agree with like i just said non-comedogenic so obviously your pores don't get blocked by using this that it's free from fragrance sulfates and parabens which is a shame that the other products couldn't have like no fragrance in them i'm glad that at least one of the things in the range doesn't have any fragrance not that the fragrance lasts with the rest of the products it's just that generally I tend to prefer fragrance free and I know a lot of other people are like that as well but yeah like I said I actually really like this SPF I think it's great addition to everyone's collection especially if you're looking for something quite lightweight non-greasy and easy to use underneath your makeup so overall I have to say that I'm very happy with this range I think it's great for people that have got problematic skin acne prone skin I'd probably say that my standout products are definitely this one and this one here they're obviously the ones that contain the most salicylic acid which should be no surprise I think that all of you would benefit from having a product like either of these ones you don't necessarily have to have both and you also don't have to use all these products together you can just use them now and then add them to your skincare regime if you're looking for something different and you want to try something with a little bit of salicylic acid in it's completely up to you which one of these things you want to use but if you are somebody who suffers from regular breakouts and are concerned about your pores looking really blocked you will definitely
definitely like something like this. If you get regularly blocked pores, probably the facial scrub will work quite nicely for you because it really unblocks those areas and it really keeps everything really looking nice and fresh. I obviously really like the SPF as well. I'm big on SPFs. I own like a million. So this is going to be going straight into my collection. And I have obviously been using this for the past few weeks and I have absolutely no complaints. So that's it for my review of the Nip and Fab Salicylic Fix range. Like, comment, make sure you subscribe to my channel. Let me know if you've got any thoughts or anything like that about any of these products. If you've tried any of them, what are your favorites? Let me know below. Other than that, I hope you guys are wonderful, great, and wishing you all fabulous, beautiful, gorgeous looking skin. And I'll see you all in the next video. Bye!